Hello, Senior Stoner fans. It's the real Senior Stoner back at you for your Puffco Peak Pro with a special insert and Turk Pearl and Bloom Extracts King Louis Distillate. Dab of the day. Hello, everybody. Thanks for joining me. As always, if you enjoyed today's video, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button. Join the family. Send a like. And I respond to all comments. Today, we're going to talk about personal credibility. We're going to talk about the fact that you don't just wake up one morning and get it. You've got to build it. Well, many people think personal credibility is only useful when you're applying for a job. But you couldn't be further off the reality. Personal credibility is like trust. It takes a long time to build it, and it can be lost instantaneously. Personal credibility is about building a bond with yourself. It's about being able to trust yourself and knowing that your words matter. Building personal credibility gives a major boost to your confidence and self-esteem. And it also helps you reaching your goals in life. You know what? It's essential because lack of credibility slays your character. Having credibility in the eyes of the public can get you far in life but it can be faked. Remember that. Personal credibility cannot be faked as long as you always know the truth. So how do we build personal credibility? Well, you've got to be honest with yourself. Honesty is point number one. Keeping it real is the absolute best way to build personal credibility. The trust that you build with yourself by being honest is immeasurable. You have to make sure you're honest with yourself in all aspects of your life. You've got to be squeaky clean. you got to avoid selling yourself the story that everything's okay when you know the shit is hitting the fan. Doing that won't get you anywhere. When things go wrong, people with personal credibility acknowledge it and start working on ways to turn it around. It's the only way things are going to get better. Going a step further and apply this principle with everyone around you. If you make a mistake, let them know and show them what you're doing to correct it. This will not only build trust with others, but it will improve your character and enhance your personal credibility. Be consistent. Consistency can build or break your personal credibility. You can be a consistent slacker as much as you can be a consistent overachiever. So be careful which way you're going to go. If you say you're going to do something, do it. Don't sell yourself short under any circumstances. The key to my success, I believe, was my credibility. I did what I said and said what I did for all the years. So in order to build personal credibility, you've got to be consistent. Think about how you'd feel if you decided to walk a mile three times a week for the next month. And halfway through, you stopped. At first, you'd feel great about accomplishing your goals and being able to stop all the negative thoughts that prevented you from getting started in the first place. But the moment you skip a day and stop, you'll feel a deep sense of failure. One that can only be subdued by telling yourself lies that you were too busy or too tired or that it was okay to skip it just that one time. But guess what? That one time turns into the new norm. You get back into habits. Don't beat yourself up too much though. If you skip a day, get right back on that treadmill the next day. Nobody's perfect. So there are gonna be days where you lose control for one reason or the other. But don't let those days ruin your life. Grab your life by the horn and get back on track. Personally credible people are accountable. If you don't hold yourself accountable for your actions, you will have a hard time building personal credibility. Being accountable is the ability to admit your mistakes. There's not much more to it. There's only maybe one thing you try to learn from your mistakes also. What led you to make that mistake type of thing? Well, maybe even go further and say, what led me to do the mistake and how do I fix it? It's about loving yourself. 
It's about loving yourself and your personal credibility will tie in. Be considerate of other people. Being considerate of others, even in situations where they might not deserve it, is a powerful way to improve personal credibility. Sometimes you'll feel like everyone's against you and it's during those times that you might want to strive even more to be considerate about those around you. Holding other people's feeling and respect may mean nothing to you, but it can mean everything to them. What you need to remember is that the positive vibes you get from others dramatically improve your self-esteem. And the better you feel about yourself, the more your personal credibility will grow. Be a student. Life's going to throw things at us that you've never seen before. Situations that you'll have no idea how to react to. But just because you don't know how to deal doesn't mean you should give up. On the contrary, that is when you need to become a student. The best weapon against ignorance is awareness, education, and knowledge. Our ability to get past barriers that life throws plays a major part in building our personal credibility. Be a student of life. Ask around when you don't know something. Read a book. Use Google. Do whatever you need to do to understand the situation. And with that knowledge, get past it. You're going to experience, we all do failure along the way, but the fact that you gave it your best will give your personal credibility a huge boost. Personal credibility, now you clearly see, is built from within. It's the relationship you have with you, with yourself, the feeling of self-worth, and knowing that you're a person of your word. Building personal credibility is definitely a skill that can be learned and taught. So we try to do some of the things we just talked about to boost our personal credibility. We might get to levels that we never thought possible. You got to remember, you cannot build that personal credibility without taking full responsibility for your actions. And remember, the only way to create change in your life is by creating new habits. You can't get different results by doing the same thing. Well, it is definitely hard to look at yourself in the mirror when you're lying, when you know you're lying. But there's a reason for that. The reason is you need to be true to yourself. Personal credibility starts at home. It starts with you. That's right. Look in the mirror. That's where personal credibility begins and ends. And as I say to everybody, my grandfather's words, do the very best you can. I'm 64 today. Yesterday, actually. Now I'm 64. And I've learned in my 64 years. You know what I've learned? You can't please everybody. So you know who you got to try to find a way to please? Guess who? You. Why do you improve personal credibility? Because you want to give gifts to everybody out there? No. Because you want to improve your own life. Your own support system with people around you. Build your personal credibility. It will come back to you in spades. Whatever work you put in building your personal credibility, I promise you will get return multiple times. This has been The Real Senior Stoner, talking about personal credibility. If you enjoyed it, you know what to do. Thanks so much for joining me today, everybody. This is one of those topics that's dear to my heart, and I'm sure it's going to be important to all of you too. Personal credibility. Cheers, everybody, and have a great day. go. Extremely tasty.
Have a great day, everybody.